Hello everyone, Andy here, back with Andy's Dinosaur Reviews, here for another review today. I'm going to review some more of the Safari LTD 2018 line. You're probably bored with it at this point, but who knows, maybe not. I'm going to get three more dinosaurs today, which these are the last three that I have. I haven't had a chance to purchase a few of the other ones like the Mastodon or anything like that. But I'm going to show you right now. One is the regular Ceratops. One is the Ankylosaurus. And my favorite of the entire line this year, the Anzu. Now all three of these figures are awesome. I cannot lie. These are my three favorite that they've released this year. And the funny thing is when I saw, whoops, there he goes. When I saw, oh my god, will you just stand up? When I saw the uh, regular Ceratops and the uh, promotional pictures, I thought, he looks okay, but I, I didn't really get too excited about him until I actually purchased him. And, uh, again, my camera's not gonna focus like usual. Until I actually purchased him and got him out of the uh, box. And I thought, wow, that thing is stunning. It is very, very nice. The detail they put into this is probably the best out of all of the newer figures, in my opinion. I mean, there is just detail all over the place. The paint job is also great. It looks very, very convincing, if you ask me. Even the crest is nicely done. Safaris, as far as the figures that I got this year, their paint jobs have been kind of sloppy with a lot of them, but this one was not sloppily done at all. It looks almost like somebody actually took some time to care for this one. The uh, eyes have a nice gloss on them to make him really appear alive to me. Great detail on the underside as well. So I would definitely recommend him. The Ankylosaurus also is beautiful. Uh, yeah, the Ankylosaurus detail all over the place again. They really took their time with this sculpt. Did a great job with it. Nice big club to bash you in the face with if you get too close and anger him. Paint job is also awesome on this one as well. We also have the nice gloss finish on the eyes which you can't see because my camera is stupid. But I'll try to take a couple of still shots, I guess. Maybe to show you guys just how nice this figure is. He looks very convincing. And the Anzu is also, oh my god, I can't even begin to describe. This is my favorite out of all of them this year. This thing, when I got it out, I was blown away. I cannot recommend the Anzu enough. It is just beautiful. Everything about it, the paint job is so well done. The feathers were sculpted incredibly well. Everything about this model just is awesome. And if you uh, associate with other people in the dinosaur collecting community, I'm probably not the first person to preach to you how nice this model is. Probably won't be the last. So if you are a fan of feathered dinosaurs or any type of dinosaur, but specifically feathered ones, I would get on the Anzu immediately. Well, maybe not get on the Anzu. I mean, he's kind of small, or at least his figure is. Don't try to take him for a ride or anything, because you're probably going to crush him. He's kind of small. But uh, yeah, he is amazing. So, and in fact, you should probably just buy all of them because they're all awesome including the Triceratops and the uh, mammals that they've produced this year. I think everything aside, so far the only one I've really been let down with is the Amargosaurus, which isn't the worst thing in the world. I can't stress that enough for all you people that do love it. I just don't really think it's that great. I wasn't too impressed, but these three are fantastic. Can't exactly remember the prices off the top of my head, but I will put them in the description along with links to each figure on the Safari website. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.